Hey people, it's Trini, um, and if you watch any of my videos about hair, I've only done a few, but you would know that I have extremely, extremely dry scalp. Um, I have psoriasis. I use a prescription shampoo. So I am out of town for the summer, and I came to the East Coast, um, and I thought that with the humidity, my scalp would be doing so much better, um, and I found that it, it was like... Things like what you eat or stress levels, increased stress levels, like can trigger um, like flare ups, I guess you call it. So I was looking for something because I have my shampoo, but I didn't have like at home. I mix up all my own oils and stuff or like my sister in law sells this oil that she has. And so sometimes I'll buy hers. But whatever the case is, I didn't have it. I had a little bit of shea butter, but it just was not hitting the spot. So uh, my scalp is really terrible. I had a sew-in in and then like um, I had my leave out. So I went to Walgreens and I found some stuff and I was like, okay, I don't want to spend a bunch of money on things that I can't take back because I only brought carry-on. So um, I went and I got some stuff and now, oh, I got this one from Walmart. That's where I got it from. Okay, so it's called Detoxifying Tonic. It's from Design Essentials Scalp and Skin Care. Um, I don't, I don't really shop in there too often, especially not for hair products. Um, but it says that there's eucalyptus and lemon with witch hazel and peppermint oil. It's dermatologist tested, fragrance free, and dye free. So boom, this is what it looks like. This here, can you see that? The sun is shining too much. But this is what it looks like. I'll put a picture. I had a terrible first experience, but I would still recommend this product. Just listen to my story. So I get this and I'm reading it in the store. Leave on as desired. Okay. So it's nighttime. I put this in my scalp. Um, like mainly my leave-in area. I put it in my scalp. And you know, seems like it's doing a little something. So I go on about my business, you know, do whatever I need to do, take my shower. Before I get go after I get out of the shower, before I get in bed, I'm like, you know what? I know my scalp up underneath that sewing is just as dry if not more dry because i haven't been able to get to it for a couple weeks right so me i take this detoxifying tonic and say okay it's been a couple hours it seems like it's okay um i put it all up underneath the sewing and everything like saturated since it says it can i can leave it in i'm like okay i'll just wash it tomorrow after work i go to sleep and it's like 3 a.m 3 a.m. I wake up scratching my head, right? I think I woke myself up because I was scratching my head so much. So then, like, once I'm actually awake and I feel myself scratching my scalp, I'm just like, okay. Um, basically, I had to check my fingernails because it felt like my scalp was so moist that it felt like I was probably bleeding. I'm like, okay, how long have I been scratching my scalp in my sleep? Because at this point, it feels... It feels weird. It feels extremely. I am so tired. Um, I just felt the need to let you guys know about this hair product I found. Um, my scalp has been really, really dry, and I use a prescription shampoo for the dryness. Um, I just woke up, but what happened to me was I used this product. I read the instructions. The back said you can either wash it out or you can leave it in, whatever you choose. So I put this stuff in my hair and like put it all through my head. Mind you, I had a sew in. So all of my edges in the middle is left out, like all around the edges. But then before I go to bed, I'm just like, okay, well, you know, my, you could see how bad my scalp, how dry it was up underneath the sew in. So I proceed to take the product and put it up underneath the sew-in. Apply detoxifying tonic directly to the scalp or skin, parting through the head. Optional, use cotton ball when using on skin. Massage detoxifying tonic onto scalp slash skin, focusing on problem or irritated areas. Rinse or leave on as desired. Okay, so it says rinse or leave on as desired. Let me read the top part what is it about detoxifying tonic it is a scalp slash skin treatment that gently cleanses and detoxifies without water or shampooing okay 
So it's supposed to do my hair to detoxify it, get my scalp together without shampooing or water. Why? I wake up at 3 a.m. and my scalp feels like it's literally bleeding. Like it just starts itching profusely, like the, the top part. So I'm laying in bed and I'm like, okay, I can't keep scratching my head like this. I know my nails are sharp. And I look at my hand because it feels like wet and tender. And I'm checking to see if it's bleeding. And it's not. It's not bleeding. The scalp is still, you know, dry. Because um, I washed it last night. And then I really didn't put much on it. Um, and then, like, this area right here where, like, my edges are or were. Um, it's really... It was really, really tender, but I put some shea butter on it last night, and I think that helped it a lot. I have the sewing in my hair, right? So, I tried to wash underneath, like, just make sure some water got underneath there while I washed the edges the first time. <sighs> Wrapped it up, lay down. A few minutes later, underneath the sewing, started feeling the same way as the edges. So I got out of bed at like 3.08 a.m., got back into bed at like 4.30 a.m. I'm exhausted. And I just wanted to let you know that if you feel the need to try this, wash it out. It says that you don't have to, but you might want to wash it out. So I'm going to tell you long story short. That was a long story, Dean. So the long story short is that if you get this detoxifying tonic, I know they sell it more places than Walmart. Do not leave it in for hours on end. I know it says to leave on as desired. Um, I did try it again and I do feel like it has helped my scalp. Um, you know, it's not 100% like healthy or where it should be, um, but I, I did try it again. I left it on maybe for like, 10 or 20 minutes this time before I washed it out and I do feel like it helped and then I also at Walgreens I found this um, essential oil mix five essential oils made by African pride it's a moisture miracle so I found this oil and then I used this um, after I used the detoxifying and shampooed and condition I put in this oil here which has castor grapeseed, argan, coconut, and olive oils. Um, also vitamin E. So cheap hair products on vacation. If you have dry scalp, I, th I think they do a decent enough job just with this detoxifying tonic. Don't leave it in overnight. Don't leave it. I would not leave this on for more than 20 minutes, honestly. Don't do it. But it will help you if you have like a chronic scalp issue or psoriasis or something like I have so thank you for watching I hope this helps um when I have issues with products I like to put it on here because when I'm in the store and I'm trying to find something I always look up reviews on products um I didn't really see anything on this but I was also in a rush so maybe there was I don't know but I just wanted to come on here and let you know design essential scalp and skin care don't leave it on overnight all right, best wishes, and I hope your scalp is doing well. Um, if you've watched this video, I hope it helps. Have a great day. I'm off to the beach. Oh, yeah, and my bathing suit is a monokina from Amazon Prime. Go get you one.